Have you ever been working in a Google spreadsheet and wish the data would automatically stay sorted all the time? Today I'm going to show you how you can do that. My name is Tom Kalinowski. I'm the Director of Technology and Operations at Colonial IU20. Today is February 26th, 2021, and this is Tech Tips episode number 81. I actually recorded a video on how to do this, uh, Tech Tip episode number 66, which I'll link below a while ago, but um, you guys pointed out that there was a problem with that. Um, so we have a, uh, a spreadsheet, uh, a sheet here of some random data, okay? And we have some uh, sheet here of, let's say, some student IDs and homerooms. The problem uh, was that if we uh, were to go start typing in some data, um, I don't know, let's just say Jack and his ID number is 15, okay? We see that uh, that automatically sorts, which is perfect. The problem is the script we were using in uh, this sheet automatically applies that logic to all of our sheets. So if, if we were using this sheet uh, for something else, right, and we started to just type something in here, let's say Smith, you'll see it automatically sorted this by column one as well, which in most cases we probably wouldn't want. We would probably only want that auto sort to happen on one sheet. So today I'm gonna to show you how you can fix that. Um, for any of the details on how to do this um, to begin with, again, please uh, see my previous tech tip, which is linked below. Um, but so let's go to um, tools, okay, and then script editor. Okay, so we have this script. And I'll uh, also put these notes here uh, for you as well. But we want to replace all instances of this in the script with that. Okay, so the easiest way to do that is we're just going to copy that. Okay, go back here, Command F, paste. And we have two instances of that. We have one here and one here. Okay, let's go back to our notes. And we're going to copy this back here. Okay, and we're going to paste that in there. Okay and we're gonna paste that in there. Let's try that again, highlight, paste, perfect. Okay, the only other thing we need to change is uh, we need to specify the name of the sheet that we want to apply this to, uh, not name of sheet, unless the name of your sheet was uh, name of your sheet, not likely though. So let's go back here, we see that the sheet that we want it on is called sheet one, okay? So we're gonna go back here, okay? And where it says name of sheet, we're gonna type in sheet one, and we're gonna do the same thing here, sheet one. And we're gonna save that. And that's it. Uh, so we'll go back here, uh, just for good measure, we'll refresh our project, okay? And uh, we'll start to type something in here. Let's go 65. Let's see if that auto sorts, it does, perfect. Okay, and let's go over to here. And let's uh, resort this by something else. Let's just go county, okay? So everything's sorted by county now. And let's go type something in at the end of this data set. Let's type in Jones, for instance, and hope that it does not auto sort. And it does not, which is great. That means it worked. So uh, thank you for your feedback on the previous tech tip. Uh, so this one updates that code a little bit just so it only sorts on a particular sheet. I hope that you found this tip valuable. Please make sure to click on the subscribe button and the bell button below. That way you'll be alerted anytime we put out new tips for you. Have a great day and I hope to see you next time.